What's up, guys? I got a bitch about something. I'm sick of McDonald's. Anyone else sick of McDonald's? I'm not talking about the taste of the garbage food that goes in you. I'm talking about the price, man. Like, for what it actually is now. And then, like, they don't give a shit. I know they make minimum wage. I know they don't make much. But take some pride in your shit, man. When you're charging 30 bucks for two hamburger combos. And you don't even get them. You get fries and a six-pack nuggets. And then attitude? Fuck. What's the point? You can go to a goddamn restaurant and order two hamburger combos that are properly made with like real beef and service with a smile for like maybe $10 more in total. Fucking sick of it. Like you people make me sick. Take some pride, man. I've said a million times before. I don't give a fuck if you're shoveling shit. Take pride in what you do. How do you go to work and hate life all day long where you're so pissed off you fuck up other people's shit? What's on you, man? Don't be a loser. Smile. Sure shit's hard. But the more you fucking are miserable about it and hate life, you're, where, where are you going to go? What positive's going to come from that shit? Anyways, I've had enough. Fuck McDonald's. No, I mean, it's a fucking mess, man. It's sick. Everybody's so miserable. I even look at dudes like my buddies and that. They make like 38 bucks an hour, full benefits. They own a house. They don't have much payments left on it. And they cry every day how they hate their fucking lives. You hate your life because you hate yourself. That's all that shit is. Ah, this fucking little camera's shit. These bumps are terrible. Sorry, guys. I don't got the mic hooked up right now either, so the, the, the audio is going to be a bit messed up. But bear with me here. I had to get this out there. I'm pissed off, as you can see. But Christ, man. No, it's getting really bad out here, especially in my neighborhood. Like, people really don't care anymore. They don't give a shit, like, about anything. I'm talking about, I'm talking about everything in general. Like, look at these people's properties. I live in Rexdale. Now, in Rexdale, everyone thinks Rexdale is this ghetto-ass hood and gangster this and gangster that. Well, sure it is. It is. There's fucking nut jobs here. And there are hoods here. But at the same time, there's boroughs in Rexdale that are still beautiful, that have been here for years, that are safe as hell. Now, I'm talking about the old school, like Italians that bought them years ago, and the British and that, or whatever the country you're from, I don't give a fuck where you're from. They kept them nice. I'm talking about old school people here. Old school Asian, old school wherever the hell you're from. They're nice. Now, they've handed them down to their kids. Everything handed to them. Never worked for fuck all in their lives. Like their parents did when they came to this country with nothing and built something of it. Now I'm watching this shit. Some of these, now you know what I'm talking about, I'm not even Italian, but old school Italians, their properties are beautiful, beautiful. You know that. Now I'm watching these kids get handed these properties and they've gotten the shit, they don't cut the fucking grass. You got a $2 million beautiful property, your parents busted their ass to fucking put together for you and handed it down for you. So you have less responsibility in life and you can't even mow the lawn? You can't even trim a hedge? Are you not embarrassed? I'd be embarrassed. Like, that's sad, man. It, it's, it's sick. This whole area has gone to shit. Be proud of yourselves, man. Be proud of what you got. I don't care what it is, even if it's small. Be proud. You know this piece of shit. Cut me off. Eh, another piece of shit. Look at this guy, no indicator. Who the fuck are you, pal? I dare you to pull over. See? Bitch. Everyone's a tough guy in a car. That's another thing I like to talk about too. Why is everyone a tough guy in a car? You, you, you think someone's not going to get out and pull you out of the car? I've seen it happen. Done it. Not proud of it. Fucking done it though. But anyway. Peace.